NC TV 45 presents the thought for the day. Monday through Friday, we give you a message of spirituality and inspiration. Your host. I'm Louis Bosco, director of junior high faith formation for the Catholic community of Newcastle. And this is your thought for the day. Before he died on the cross, Jesus said, Father, into thy hands I commit my spirit. This act of total surrender was the perfect fulfillment of our Lord's earthly life, a life completely devoted to doing the Father's will. St. John Vianney, the cure to ours, reflected in prayer, I love you, O oh my God, and my desire is to love you until the last breath of my life. I love you, O oh my infinitely lovable God, and I would rather die loving you than live without loving you. I love you, Lord, and the only grace I ask is to love you eternally. My God, if my tongue cannot say in every moment that I love you, I want my heart to repeat it to you as often as I draw breath. Jesus spent his life following the will of the Father. Sometimes we are afraid to follow God's will in our own life. We are afraid that following the will of God will mean not being able to do the things we really want to do. This may well be true, but often doing what we really want to do doesn't make us very happy in the end. When we follow God's will, we are following the will of the one who created us, who knows us better than we know ourselves, and who alone knows what will make us truly happy. We should be unafraid to follow the example of Jesus and place our own lives in the Father's hands. I'm Louis Bosco, and this is your thought for the day.